Okay guys, it's Anders here and today it's going to be quite a quick video and I'm going to apologize in advance. Lots of the screen's going to get blurred because we're going to be going into my private account and there's other people's releases and things in there. But just forewarning, this is purely so that you can have a bunch of info, but I don't want to be showing other people's personal info, release information and such and such. So this is how to get submitted onto Spotify playlists via your DistroKid account. It's a pretty simple process. Let's start by going over to DistroKid. So once we're on here, our main page is gonna have all of our releases on it and the stores that they are all going into. We want to navigate across the top to the stats page. So within the stats page, we have this little bar at the top where we've got our streams and albums and tracks. Just below it, we've got the Spotify estimates and the Spotify artist login. So what we need to do here is select artist and then click get access. So I'm just gonna, blur this out so you can't see it, log into the one that we need and hit get access. So here we need to log in with our Spotify account. What I suggest doing is having a separate account if you're a Spotify user and having just an account for managing your artists or artist pages. If you're just a solo artist and you never intend to release anything else, sure thing, bump it out on your normal account, but I would recommend having your own. So we need to agree to what we're going to do if we haven't already and submit. The account I'm going to log into is already approved by the way, so we'll be able to step right through. So once everything's been approved, up in the top left hand corner, your little icon, or it will just be a grey head depending on how you've set up your account, will have a little blue tick next to it. This is a good sign. Now we want to know about getting into the playlist. If you have a look, I've got a Warrior Sound beat coming out. It says Warrior Sound in the slow lane. And look, it says upcoming release. So it hasn't come out yet. It releases in three days from today. And you can see that I submitted it eight days ago. That doesn't mean it was submitted to Spotify. It means it was submitted to a playlist by myself. So how would we go about doing this? Well, we need to navigate to the catalog over on the left hand side here. This is gonna give us all of the releases we've got on there and streams and things that are happening for them. And you know, freely you can see the tracks that I've put out and the Spotify streams here. Um, you know, then it's my beat catalog. It's by no means the way it makes income, but we throw them up there. Even if this generates me one extra client, it's well worth it. We need to flip over to upcoming and this will show any upcoming releases. And you can see I've got three queued up. Feb 1st, Feb 15th and March 1st. They're around two weeks split apart and the reason for that is you need a two week approximately threshold to get submitted into playlists. So as you can see at the moment, this one is submitted for a playlist. It is in the slow lane, submitted eight days ago by myself for a release date on February 1st. Now, if I wanted to submit a different one, I would have to unsubmit the first. You can only have one song submitted to a playlist approval at any one time. So once we've done that and selected it, we can go through the process of submitting it. Now in this case, I've already done it. So we are going to view song submission. So what we can see here are the details and areas that we chose. So you're going to get given a bunch of things that we need to make sure we cover. So I've got it in the genre of hip hop, subgenres, alternative hip hop, because it's an instrumental music culture, Buddhist, because some of the instrumental elements contained in there, it's quite a laid back chill beat. It's got some Asian oriented instruments in there. So it sticks nicely in that. That gives it a meditative mood with chill as its other category. Song style and lyric, well, it's going into beats because it's just a beat and instrumental. We've got instrument types, bass, guitar, organ, drum kit, synthesizer, and a chorus. Is it a cover? No. Is it a remix? No. Is it an instrumental? Yes. Recording style studio, quick description of who it might suit um, and any other artists it might kind of relate to. And in this case, I've done my location, but you can do the recording location or whatever it is you need. And then we submit that. That, guys, is as simple as that. This doesn't guarantee approval, but it does guarantee that someone is going to listen to at least part of that track and decide if there's a playlist or a playlist algorithm set that it would sit nicely in for people to discover your music. So I hope that is helpful for you, and uh, I will see you guys on the next one.